Hi everyone, it's Charlotte here today and we're going to be doing a Chinchillas 2 shop haul. So this has got some toys in it and it's also got some treat kind of stuff. And yeah, I'm really excited to show you everything and this is one of my favourite shops. They are run by a lovely lady called Linda and she is based in the UK and sadly she doesn't ship worldwide. I think it's because of some of the goods that are like perishables and food kind of based things for guinea pigs and rabbits and kind of other small animals so sending them abroad is a lot harder through customs so I think that's why she doesn't send abroad but I'm really really sorry for those that are abroad because I know that a lot of my subscribers are from America especially now there are other shops in America that I would highly recommend for kind of similar based things these are kind of a, a shop that has kind of pre-made stuff more so but she makes these amazing amazing things and that is Twilight Chinchillas and I would highly highly recommend her she, I've had our garland off her and loads of other like little kind of like willowy toys and my pigs at the time really adored them and I would probably buy more if the shipping and customs wasn't so expensive from Canada and the US and everything so that is a great shop to look at if you are interested in a similar kind of like feel for a shop anyway I shall get on with the haul and we've got a little button in front of us because I thought we'd instead of me just filming the <laughs> blank thing before I get out the stuff I thought we'd have a little button in it and he was quite willing to sit in front of the camera weren't you honey oh thank you but yeah, so I'll get on with the haul and I hope you enjoy. So the first two items that I've got here, I've just put them together because they're very, very similar. And it is some blueberry wood twigs. And I think it's a pack of 14 twig sticks, 14 blueberry twig sticks. And these were £2.50. And I will put all the price on the screen because I have actually got the receipt here though for everything. So I can read it out. But um... I'll put it on the screen just in case you miss it but yeah these look really really nice and there's a lot of different thicknesses as well you can see that one there is a really really decent size and I'm excited to see what they think of them they're just kind of like little extra like toys that I can give them in the cage and obviously because they're all natural and they've got the blueberry it's just a lovely lovely natural treat to give them and I know that my pigs do like chewing on wood just chewing on anything really and then we've got these apple wood and these are three medium apple sticks they don't actually do these in the twigs I don't think or they didn't in stock the time that I bought these and there's three of them in here and these were £1.69 and as you can see they're a lot lot thicker and you could easily drill oh actually I think there are holes yeah there are <laughs> I was just about to say you could easily drill holes through but there are actual holes already through them so you could put them on a kebab or any kind of other type of like hanging toy and I think some of these have actually got holes through as well so that's actually very useful if you want to add them to toys instead of just having them on the floor the next two items I'm sure a lot of you will recognise and these are some willow ball stuff with nice timothy hay you can purchase these with or without the hay but I think it's like an extra, extra 19p for having it stuff with the hay and it's definitely definitely worth it because they really do love this hay and I believe it's the Oxbow Timothy hay that Linda stuffs it with and these are yeah the stuffed vine balls and they're £1.99 each and they're a really decent size so they fit in my hand really nicely and for £1.99 they're an absolute bargain for willow balls because I know that a lot of them at shops like Pets at Home and similar kind of pet superstores are super duper expensive and even online a lot of them are really expensive so they're normally like four quid each and that's without being stuffed and I just think it's crazy so I really love these and so do the pigs they definitely destroy them and they love the hay inside going along with the ball theme we've got some more seagrass balls and these are just you can see they're like wrapped seagrass I've actually still got one of these and the hay has been eaten inside because pigs just love it <laughs> But the existing like outside of it is still intact and it's really really good it stands up by itself really nicely and these have been put up 10p they used to be £1.89 and they were 
slightly less obviously than the Vine balls, but they're now £1.99 so they're exactly the same price. They are a little bit smaller, but there's obviously a lot more work that goes into them because it's seagrass and it's all like woven and everything, but they absolutely adore these. And I always like to now get two because I've got four pigs and I like to have a ball between two to prevent like squabbling. I'm sure they would rather have a ball each, but <laughs> having four balls in a cage is a bit ridiculous, so I stick it with the two. The next item is something I've seen on the shop for a while, but I wasn't really sure if I wanted to get it. It was originally I believe a $7.99 or maybe a little bit more but this time it was actually on offer for $2.99 so I just grabbed it and I thought yeah I'll definitely have this now you're probably thinking why am I buying a ledge and the reason I've got this is not to keep this end I want to try and remove this but what I want I really like having like big chunks of wood for them just to either jump on and especially this size because it's going to be flat to the ground that they can like have a little jump on it and chew it and take the bark off and I just think it's nice to provide a big like natural wooden log but I thought this was a good opportunity to take advantage of the sale and I really like it I think they're going to really enjoy it and I hope they will I might try a few of these out later on in the haul and see what they think of them the next two items are the tan bangles and these were £1.39 for a pair of two and these are really really cute I've never used these before or ever bought them and I know they do larger ones and I think maybe some smaller ones but these are a really nice little add-on toy and you could well put it on like a hanging toy too and I'm not really sure I'm going to do with them I might just give them to them free but they're really really sweet and they're just like made out of vinyl willow and I just think they're really cute and for £1.39 you can't really go wrong it's funny how when I get the food items out the button comes over <laughs> and you, you're a funny boy aren't you? oh are you enjoying that head rub? anyway these are the pea flakes and I've never actually really tried the pigs with these before they have been in some of the other like mixed kind of treat bags but I've never tried them just solely alone and I have to admit I did try them last night with the pigs and Clara was the main one who liked them the most the other three weren't so bothered but they do tend to take a while to get used to treats so I'm sure that in time they will start eating them more but these were the 250 gram peas and these were £1.69 I really like them and I think that they're a nice natural treat and not too high in fat but I would still recommend not overfeeding these either just on a treat basis and the last items that I purchased in this haul were these meadow hay rolls and these are completely new to Chinchilla Sue Shop and I believe that you can break them up into smaller chunks they're basically just compressed hay I think they'd be quite a nice extra little addition and enrichment for them I wouldn't substitute these completely for actual hay because they're just it's not as good for them to get it out plus also they're not in really like long chunks or anything so I would definitely still recommend feeding loose hay all the time and have plenty of it available for your small animals especially guinea pigs and rabbits so that's everything I got from chinchillas tea shop thank you very much for watching and I may put in some footage just after this and show you the pigs having a munch on some of the items I'm not going to give them all of them at once obviously because it kind of ruins the point of them being treats so yeah so I hope you enjoy that if I do and I shall speak to my next one thank you very much for watching bye what do you think of this? Well, they definitely seem to approve of the log. <laughs> Especially Dav. Dav loves just getting on the top of things. I'm going to give them some of this hay roll. I'm trying to get it out without making a mess of the idea. I'm going to by putting it this end of the cage because normally this is the sleeping area. Hang on. That's a sure sign that they like it. Finn, over here. Finley. 
Okay, we're all gonna go together. Well, I think that was definitely a hit, so I'm very impressed and happy with my purchases so far. And thank you so much for watching again, and I shall speak to my next one. Bye!